Hello everyone, Rituro here with another episode of Blue and White, my video diary, let's play video review of Football Manager 2014 and the Vancouver Whitecaps. Last time we finally, finally managed to bump our winless slump in MLS with a 2-1 victory over the New England Revolution. Two goals from Camilo and a penalty goal by AJ Soares were the tallies and we move on to a crucial absolutely crucial midweek match against Chivas. Uh, this is going to be a big one, folks, because uh, we need to make up points in the West, and beating Chivas at home is one of our best chances to do it, so hopefully we can do so. Uh, Vilchez made his debut. Good for him. Uh, do do do. Uh, as standing today, he's a good player. To Portland? Uh, da, da, da. Yep. Ugh, DC lost to Toronto. Oof, horrible. How bad are they? Fifth place? They are... Oh, in the, in the east. I see. Oh, well, it's way better than they did in real life. Uh, in 2013, DC United, MLS record for worst season ever. Scouting YP Lee. You know what? If I could get a serviceable right back to fill his boots, I'd consider it. But I don't have one, so no. Uh, yeah, who do I have on defender right in our area that I've actually scouted who would come play for us? I know none of these people will come over. Gaddis is listed? Really? Is he primary? He is primarily a right back. He's on a cheap deal. Uh, assigned scout. Get me a report on him, please. Because that might be a good way to go. Let's uh, add him to the short list. It'd be nice to pick him up. Okay, do it and ditch Tierney in the process. Even better. Jackson. 2.5 a week. 23 years old. Add to short list. I'd have to designated player him. Let's, uh, I said an asking price of 220000 That's interesting. Um, I'm going to just undercut that. Uh, Jamie Williams' report is a good one. What, what is my current roster situation? Before I go signing people here, how much space do I actually have? I have space for two players, one of which can be international, one of which can be rostered. So I could do it. I could pull in this kid and bring in... You know, then I'd have to trade for... Hmm. So i got space. I've got the space, and that's good. Got potential. If I get a 3.5 out of it, let's see if I can get him. Let's make an offer of. Nope. Chris Tierney. And make that offer. All right. Uh, oh, right. Let's uh, approach him to sign. Once drafted. Okay. Uh, declare interest. Transfer. Hmm, that could be interesting. Let's get 
for you. Sanchez is a double hernia. Ooh. Two to three months. Well, so much for that trial. Goodbye. They want 185000 for him. Installments, payments, profit percentage. See, the thing is, he has to be good. And right now, I've got him listed as four, which is good. But I want to be absolutely certain. Yeah, I mean, get me some... Uh, That's great. Draw. Jake DeClute is scouting Mexico after a spell in the U.S. Yes, I'm sure you found all these wonderful people that I have no interest in acquiring. Picasso Lester is now with Maccabi Tel Aviv. Well, that's great. Uh, meanwhile, there's this. Let's, uh, yeah, Cortiba. In the first division. No, no history. Can I see their matches? Matches. Oh, good. So that does show up. I might actually be able to scout him, which is good. All right, no Saturday match. I think I do have another. Do I have another Wednesday match coming up, or do the following Saturday? I want to get a friendly in at some point. Ugh, DeVio Player of the Week. I clearly had a better candidate for Player of the Week. I mean, Camilo, obviously. Good. Uh, Dave Brown's progression has improved over the last month. Shoot from long range. First, he's got to get that DLP. That's right, this is our youngster who we signed. He's got some first-year experience. Uh, let's take a look at his development, shall we? Well, it's improved. That's good. Anything that involves him improving is good by me. Oh, goal of the week. Yeah, Camilo with goal of the week. Excellent. Speak to Camilo. Congratulations. Yeah, tops the lot. Well, that was a good one. Jimenez is close to be back. Maddox has been developing, thank goodness. Oh, some international reports. What have we got here? Ugh, not a good day at the office for Turnbull. Or for Mitchell, I should say. Anyone else did all right? Alderson and Clark not so good with the U twenties. This Chance guy who's still on trial. Uh, St. John's don't want Matt Watson. Really? Uh, he's valued a little higher than that. So let's just up his worth, shall we? He's worth a little bit more than that. And I want uh, uh, what do I want? Percentage of next sale, fifteen percent. We can negotiate that. Ooh, they want Fath on loan. Uh, yes, yes, that sounds like a. Good first team soccer option. Chelsea. Really? On July 23rd, huh? I have a match in the middle, but, uh, sure. What the hey? Uh, all right, what else could I get? Gaddis. Player. Where is he? Gaddis. Hmm. What if I gave you Tierney and money? 
I've got some allocation money. Uh huh. Friendly against the Dutch. They lost no big deal. And Guillermo Moreira. Not interested. All right. Here we go. Oh, Hurtado does not want to go on loan. Chance, we've determined he's not good. Those on trial with me. Uh, more international reports. Tybert did all right. Jimenez has resumed training. Thank goodness. Uh, Cortiba have negotiated. 185. Hmm. Let's knock that down to 100. And 160 that way. 15. Make offer. Of course, it depends whether or not I can even afford his salary unless he asks for something, you know, insane. All right, who do we got here? Eric Avila is ineligible. Gabriel Farfan is ineligible. Three other players are injured. Well, that works for me. All right, for this midweek match, do we have Thomas back? Not yet. Everybody else looks good, though. This lineup did well for us last time. So let's keep the good thing going. I'll bring Vilches on at halftime, though. Get him in for Leveron. All right, everybody. Let's pick up right where we left off, shall we? Or, ooh, Jimenez. Oh, Jimenez is not fit to get back in. Brown might be. You know what? I do regret not putting Dave Brown in there. Ah, oh, silly, silly, silly. Should have put him in. All right. Victory for Chivas. Pfft. Watch me make you eat those words. I'll make you eat those words. And no El Cubo, no Eric Torres. Excellent. And we'll cut you down. All right. Uh, go out there and impress me, everybody. Hey, they liked that. Good, I like this. We're all going to be happy. Good. Let's continue what we did last time. Keep possession. Control the match. And away we go. Vancouver versus Chivas USA. Oh, looks like another boss is in the stand scouting. It's not going to help. Oh, I don't like where this is going. Oh, Edgar Maya with the free kick in a very dangerous area. Well, it's all right, it's an early goal, which we seem to always give up against Chivas in the real world. All right, well, should, all I have to do now is get it back. Yeah, it looked like a dive for, sir, for sure. All right, come on, everyone. Short passing play? Well, let's try it. I mean, man, we got this possession. We've got passing. We should put ball into net. Shots are 12 to 2. Ball in net. All right. Nothing happening out wide here. Okay, Max, I don't think it can play wing, which is unfortunate. Come on, guys. Show me something else in the second half. Oh, they're looking fired up. That's good. All right, O'Brien has not been looking good. So we are going to... Uh, yeah, we'll bring him out in favor of Vilches. I have faith in you. And away we go. Corners are 10 to 1. 10 to 1! How are we not just destroying them? Alright. Good. 
get out there and kick them in the butt. Knight with the goal kick. There, good job, Leveron, stepping in. Kobashi over to Rio Koger, back to McCarty. Dax McCarty finds Maddox, who chips forward to Miller. Saved by Cigaris. Or saved by Kennedy, I should say, and cleared by Cigaris. But not far, though. Rio Coker to McCarty to Kobayashi. Back to Vilchez. Vilchez. And that's where the play ends. All right. It's clear Maddox is not having much luck up front. We are putting in Kakuta Mane. Mane, you are hopefully the Mane with the plan. Looks like Chivas made a substitution there as well. So we'll get... Mana Informatics. Uh, Rick Cooker gets a card. No surprise there. Yeah, let's get Kobayashi out for Matt Watson. Alright, Matt Watson. Up to you. Daniel Henry's not having a good game. He'll have to come off. We'll replace him with Rusin for the next game. Oh my goodness, we're not going to lose to Chivas 1-0, are we? We are seriously not losing to Chivas 1-0. Yes, I agree. Direct. Come on, guys. Shots are 14-4. to Here we go. Camilo with the cross. Nothing doing. Miller chases it down. In the corner. Back to Knighton. Back to YP Lee. To Vilchez. Vilchez to Watson. To McCarty. To Watson. Up to Leverone. Saved by Dan Kennedy. Come on, boys. Keep piling that pressure on. Get the equalizer. Camilo with the corner. Oh, come on. That was never a foul. Oh, come on. Please don't lose to Chivas. Please don't lose to Chivas. Please don't lose to Chivas. Take the ball back and go field. Oh, my goodness. I don't believe I've lost this. Oh, my goodness. That was just unlucky, though. I mean, I can't beat them up. We dominated them in every category. And, yeah, Dan Kennedy... Oh, my goodness. Well, that's going to put a serious dent. Oh, my goodness, in our ability to get back in this thing. That was a match we needed to win, and it did not happen. Oh, I had a poor game. Hmm. Well, let's see. I mean, he's looking good. Oh, just, just undesirable. All around. YP Lee. Seriously? That's what you're offering? Let me uh, see if I can make this clear. Uh, if you're going to offer me that, I need more. And I need you to sort of, you know, approach his value. That's better. All right. It's a bit low. I mean, I'm not playing Watson. All right. Nope. Nope. Quillar. Well, we'll see if he's any good. I get. I seem to have this recollection that he was not worth our time. Six fifty-eight. No. They don't want that for Gaddis, huh? I want 
Gaddis. What do I gotta give up to get him? Gaddis, 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 Gaddis. Where did you go? Gaddis. Draft picks? I'm not getting rid of those draft picks though. So, uh, good draft picks for 2014. No, uh, it's got to be allocation money. Let's try a straight up allocation money play. Uh, huh. Cortiva negotiating. That's a little more reasonable. That's much more reasonable. Uh, oh, that's nice. Uh, no. Oh, yes. Reserve match. Right. Well, let's put... That's a good point. Who do I actually want in? All right. I know we want Thomas back in goal and Knighton on the bench. Right means DC United away, I think. I want to say away. So let's go with the 442 Diamond. We will put McCarty in the midfield. We will put <laughs> Tierney on the left. Tybert on the right, Kobayashi at the point of the diamond, Vilches on left back, Leveron there, O'Brien there, Lee there. We will keep up uh, front. Let's go with Camilo as the poacher and Miller as the setup man. In the back, let's put Ash. You know what? Let's put Lee on the bench. Let's put Nigel Rio Coker in the back, uh, and we'll put uh, Rusin and at a Kugbe. And Gershon Kofi and Dave Brown and Hector Jimenez and Darren Maddox. Whoops, one too many. Uh, out Bay. All right, that's all our bases covered for all tech tactical possibilities. So now it's just a matter of. Uh, Tierney, oh, right, fine. Uh, available for reserve squad for 60 minutes. Knighton is good. Daniel Henry can go for the full 90. And Jimenez can go until match fit. All right. Oh, right, I should see what's setting up a friendly. Yes, let's do that. Let's get a friendly setup. Because A, money, and B, oh, man, they do not want to get rid of Gaddis. Hmm. Alrighty. He wants a DP contract. Alright. Let's just tone that down, though. I don't want to be locked into a contract here. Uh, agent fee. <laughs> oh, you're not worth it. I don't think I can afford a DP contract, though, you know? I really don't know if I can afford a DP. Oh, fine. 
can I afford a DP contract? What would I have to cut to actually afford that DP contract? Uh, registration. I'm only three grand under, so I need to free up four grand worth in salary. Um, no cap hits. So who would I have to drop? My P. Lee. He would have to go. Be a straight swap out. And that wouldn't leave me much room for those kids. Although, if I get rid of Demerit after that injury, that's another question. Tierney's got a bit. Hurtado. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if I can afford it. Uh, right. Well, you know what? Maybe we'll just let him sit. Oh, right. We're losing uh, Matt Watson. That'll free some cap room up. Uh, Vilches on an individual training regime on Central Defender. No, thank you. Though on the subject of Vilches, what are you currently training as? You have no training. I want you to focus on fullback. That's where I'd like you to play. Um, St. Johnstone looking for to be playing in the Euro Cup. Uh, 3.4, I mean, that's going to free up cap room for sure. Can I afford to lose Watson? I think so. I wasn't really using him. Five thousand in allocation. Yeah, it was unlikely, and we made a profit. So there you go. <laughs> Do double hernia off the short list. You go. So that means our cap situation is much brighter now. Yeah, I got five grand. Much better. We could drop tier almost get away with dropping Tierney. Still keeping the team together. Oh, so glad those prospects are on cheap contracts. Not good for them because it's cheap. Cheap. There you go. Uh, how did that reserve match go? I'm sure we'll find out here. Or not. Hmm. I don't know if we necessarily need another D mid, but they're offering him to us. It can't hurt. It never hurts to scout, bring in the the uh, uncapped or unattached, I should say, uncapped on a trial, because why not? And new driver. Really? Alright, I'm pretty sure I've scouted him before. I have scouted him before. It's probably going to come back as not worth it. Alright, we gotta get these wins against these weak teams. DC United is one of them. Uh, Chris Clute. Seems to be that he is not as bad as we think, though uh, we'll see. Carlos Jose Fernando Marquez. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, he's a DP, though, that's not gonna happen. Excellent. Fath gets some development. Good. Oh, I was like sending the kids out. Get some, some training. Oh boy, DC United. Compile match reports. Uh, bum bum bum. Yes, not worth it. Not worth it. Oh my goodness. Whew. Oh my 
my goodness, please, please, please let this guy be the answer that I want him to be. All right. Tuesday, July 9th. Okay, good. I'm glad everybody's continuing their scouting in the USA. Uh, I don't really uh, uh, think I'm going to be signing Landon Donovan, so uh, I appreciate the thoroughness, scouts, but uh, I'm pretty sure we're going to be okay. All right, so now we're just going to skip ahead to this DC United match. Uh, yes, good for him. Blah, blah, blah. Lionel Brown, not interested. Contract guarantee date. Ugh, that's not good. If I'm gonna cut somebody, I gotta cut them soon. That's a good point. If they're making DP money, I gotta make my cuts now. You know what? Yeah, I shall have trial finishes. Don't care. Is he gonna work for cheap? Nope. He ain't working for cheap. Okay, so. Knowing what I know. Knowing the contract guarantee date is coming up. What, who can I get away with cutting? Tierney. Ah, uh, it sucks this didn't work out. It really does. I don't know if I can just offer him to clubs. Offer. For cut rate oh, I'll see if I can get away with that um anybody else I can cut Tato is not gonna make enough of a difference as I need to save it's cutting sixteen hundred and fifty five thousand brings me to fifty four forty nine or fifty four nine so 53.9, I should say. So, oh, it would not quite need to shave him and, I'm guessing, Hurtado. Yeah, it'd be, it would be Hurtado. So I can't really get rid of anybody else. Oh, boy. No oh, demerit. You and your $7,000 contract a week. All right. Well, if we don't get any... People respond to the Auburn for Tierney. He is getting cut. Uh, huh. Interesting. Gotta say, I do like these scouting updates straight to the inbox. And for, like, most of Football Manager 2014, having everything go straight to the inbox is just... Ugh, the streamlining of it is very nice. A very good upgrade over 2013. Alright, problem though is we have this, uh, oh, we have to, no, no offers. Alright, well then you're getting dropped after this game. Uh, yes, that's fine. Uh, not interested. Oh, we need to win. Need win. Autosave, help me. Please autosave. Oh, please autosave. I need your magical auto-saving powers to... Wait a minute. Seriously? Ah, oh, come on. Well, at least they're only slight favorites. All right. Oof, let me just string a matches close together here. Our depth will be tested. Uh, Ian Hume... Well, I wouldn't necessarily say that. Let's add him for another year. Um, another takeover for Chicago. It'd be interesting to see that takeover actually happens. Because I think it would be hilarious. Okay, here we go. They're going with it looks like a four four one one or a four five one, whatever you want to call that. Oh, John Thornton is injured. I'm so shocked. 
Uh, Leo Gonzalez. Hanneman's in goal for them. Dressario is their big man. All right. Are we happy with this setup? Are you really happy with this setup? Well, I think we're going to go with it. All right, here we go. Squad number will have to be given to Hector Jimenez. What number did I give him before? Oh, what number did I give Jimenez? Well, you can have 22. Seems a good number for Jimenez. So we are definitely going to lose the midfield battle here. I can see us switching back to the other formation sooner than later. All right. Well, let's uh, let's go with a counterattack. Come on, boys. Show me what you can do. Chain possession worked well into the box. Uh, let's look for overlap. All right. Here we go. DC United in black, Vancouver Whitecaps in white. And let's see how this goes. Not good off the start, possession-wise. Oh, we got the first shot. Oh, Cardi injured. Not good. And that card for a Coker. That is not a good thing. But we seem to be holding together. So Thomas with the goal kick. Does he find Miller? No. And Derosario is there to pick up the ball. And the forward ball is picked up by Thomas, who hoofs it right back downfield. Camille can't get there, though. Oh, good poke there by Vilches. This is good. This is a, some good pressing defense here. But DC does have the ball. They go around on the other side. Neil trying to get by Rio Coker. The cross goes into the middle. Derosario with the header beats Simon Thomas. Oh, who left him alone? Not good. So what do we have here? Everything looks all good. And then, oh, stepping away, Leveron and Vilches do not do their job. All right, I'm going to go ahead and say we need to target De Rosario. Uh, oh, he is being told tightly marked, but he didn't do a good enough job. And Pontius, likewise. All right, good. And I'm going to go with tightly mark and offside trap. All right, come on, boys. We need to get one back here. Well, at least the cards are being brandished. Favors us. Come on, we gotta get one back here. Over with a nice header to Miller. Over to Tybert. Up to Miller. Kenny Miller. Over to Daigo Kobayashi. Kobayashi looks forward, trying to find Camilo. Nothing doing. Punch out jumps Rio Coker, though. The ball to Neil. Oh no, oh no! No, 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 no. Ah! Bad, bad, bad. Bad Nigel Rio Coker. Ah. Alright, we're going 4 5 1. So, I'm gonna need. Somebody come on. It's gonna be YP Lee coming on. Oh, seriously? Come on, I need YP Lee in. Uh, we'll take out, I guess we'll take out McCarty's position. Oh, come on! Fine, I'll move him back here myself. I'll bring on YP Lee there. Uh, Alright, I'll have to juggle everything around here. No box to box midfielder means we move Kobayashi down to Tybert. Move Tybert over for Miller and Miller and Camilo. 
Okay, and the rest looks good. Confirming the changes, and we will hope to try and turn this around. That was perhaps the prototypical, now things are worse. Not good. Uh, at least nothing came out of that free kick, which is nice. Alright. Now we need to get up there. Okay. We've been unlucky. Yes, we have. Come on, keep that... Keep the faith. Keep the faith here. Alright, we'll counterattack. Hassle opponents, tighter marking. Work hard. Alright. Uh, let's just make sure everyone is all tightly marked here. Uh, Neil, or sorry, Pontius and Porter should all be marked and on their weaker feet. Dorsario and Pontius should be closed down. Porter and Sargosa, let's go in hard on both of them. See if we can't draw red from them as well. All right, tactical shift. Let's see if it works. Well, they seem to be more or less holding together. Which is good. Uh, let's see here. We gotta stay on our toes. Probably means bringing on... Oh, Chris Tierney's my defensive mid. Woo! Let's fix that right now. Though he's had a decent game as Chris Tierney. Not decent enough, though. I'll bring on Gershon Kofi. Into that defensive midfield role. Uh, Leveron makes a good header up to Miller. Back to Kobayashi. Kobayashi goes up wide to YP Lee. Lee to Tiber. Tiber back to Kofi. Back to YP Lee. Cuts forward to Kobayashi. Good ball here. Gets into Tiber. Tiber to Kobayashi. Finds Camilo. Camilo scores, and it's all even. Oh, 1-1. One, one. I will take a draw. If we are down to 10 players and we walk out of here with a draw, I will be thrilled. Great goal by Camilo. And Neil's coming off. Off the kickoff. Looks like we're going to see a chance, possibly, or maybe just a quick kickoff highlight. Being out-possessed, we're being out-shot, but we have even goals. And Thomas will pick the ball up here and just thump it away. Can't get to Terry Miller as Fernandez wins that header. Pontius does well to get it inside to Riley. Finds Argoza who blasts it with a rifle from just outside the box. And we are immediately pegged back. Alright, I do believe Leveron, you are coming... Actually, you know what? Vilches. Eh, let's bring off Leveron and bring in Rusin. Kind of want to bring in Dave Brown there for a... Uh, for a uh, Tybert, just for the, the experience, but uh, we got to stay sharp at the back. Who knows, maybe we equalize again here. Thomas goes up. Can't find Tybert, though. It's a hopeful long ball at best. And over on the far side, Pontius is wide open. And his ball is deflected. Oh, no penalty. Oh, there it is. Oh, on the second poke, it's a penalty. Oh. Yeah, see, the commentator agrees with me. He thinks it's harsh. Oh, my goodness. And Rosario. Oh. Wrong way goes Thomas, sliding out of his net. And that will be the end of this game. The... Attempt to salvage a draw has gone horribly sideways, and the season continues to spiral out of control. Ugh, and Vilches is just not having a good day at the office either. Yikes. Brian's not looking good. O'Brien will sit. Oh, he can't. He's my captain. I think Miller's a backup captain. And, oh, goalkeeper goal! Goalkeeper goal! <laughs> Uh, no such luck. 
Well, that's it. DC United get the win, and we lose 3-1. I am not happy. Whew. Yeah, that was a controversial penalty, and I plan on raising a little bit of a stink about that. But there are clearly oh, much, much work to do to salvage anything out of this season. We'll need some fantastic... Uh, oh, at least I am have been good in the transfer market, so woo! But that's still not winning us games. A horrible, horrible win and goal ratio, which means I got a lot of work to do. So we'll see if I can turn things around next time on Blue and White. My name is Juro. Thank you all for watching. We'll see you next time.